And today we're going to be nominating uh, a veteran, Joe, who's and Gail, his wife, uh, and they've had a really rough go at life lately. Uh, he has amnesia. She has some health conditions. She's going to dialysis, and she's not able to make her doctor's appointment. She, she had her car break down on the side of the road, and it was everything was robbed and stolen out of it. And so she's been having to Uber to and from the, the dialysis, which they can't afford. And so this car is going to be able to impact their life in a major way and really be a, a, a life-changing event. Okay, so Gail thinks she's here for uh, to meet the board to get interviewed to see if she's going to be awarded a car. She thinks she's going to be getting a car in the, no, in the November and the Veterans 13 car giveaway. So today we're going to have a complete surprise, so it's going to be exciting. I want to thank everybody for coming out, and I'm truly blessed to have all you guys out here supporting us and supporting the Duran Cherry Foundation. Um, hopefully we'll raise a lot of money. Um, with this tournament for all the charities that we support. Score One for Health, Camp Quality, Answering the Call, Midwest Animal Rescue, and of course, Car Santa. We, uh, we came out here today, and I'll tell you a little story of somebody. We have Gail over here that came out. Her husband, Joe, is 79, and Joe has, uh, he suffered from cancer a few years back, but he beat it. Gail is on dialysis, getting to dialysis a couple times a week. And uh, this last year they got sick, were in the hospital, and why they were, somebody burglarized their house, stole their car, and stripped it. And they had enough money to get it home out of the tow lot, but that was about it for the last year. They've had no transportation. She uses Uber to get to dialysis. So they're doing a little bit of struggling. Now Joe served, he went in in 1967. During the Vietnam era, he went to Germany, and all the way up, he'd served 20, 26 years, was it? We wanted to honor Joe, and unfortunately, he couldn't be here this morning, but we brought Gail out, and uh, she had mentioned in, in what she wrote that she saw a post on Shamrock Roofing Facebook page, which is my buddy Garen Armstrong here. And uh, Garen, he's been on our board 15 years, so kind of rung some bells in there and we looked and so uh, what we'd like to do Gail is honor your husband and honor you we know the whole family serves when they serve and I'm gonna turn it over to Drawn here. Gail thank you for coming and uh, on behalf of Cars for Heroes and the Duran Cherry Foundation and also all these people out here who support the Duran Cherry Foundation on behalf of them We'd like to present you with the keys to your car. Here you go. I had been praying about this for a long time. And God spoke to me that day and told me to fill the application out and tell our story. So I did, and that was two weeks ago. Yesterday I got the phone call from Terry that he wanted me to come for a final interview. I still had no clue that this was gonna happen. This was such a godsend and an answer to a prayer. I thank this organization, I thank Terry, Karen, and all the other people Duran, everybody that's involved with this group, I thank them. This is a miracle, and I'm, I want to see that miracle happen for more people.